queen of hearts. She is the queen of emotional intelligence. She leads by example with her royal energy and her compassion and love. Big love, big heart. So it's very much the energy of stepping into your vulnerability, being really vulnerable, feeling your feelings deeply, feeling all of your feelings and expressing your feelings with compassion and grace. Uh, the queen can also be a real caretaker, caretaker of others. She is very, very nurturing, but she can do it to a point of depleting herself and becoming exhausted and then becoming resentful. And then it, that would disempower others as well, enabling them, right, if she caretakes too much. She can also have so much emotion that she can explode in her passion, explode in rage and her in big, big feelings, right? So it's super important to really feel into the feelings, feel into your feelings on this Queen of Hearts day. Feel all your feelings, expressing your feelings with compassion, feeling compassion for yourself. I love the pip patterns, so I have to talk about those too. Uh, these are the pip patterns for the Queen of Hearts. Balance, perfection, absolute perfection, symmetry. Right, so the Queens also have this energy of perfection, but that can be like very rigid and the low side could get into like really being um, hard on oneself and hard on other people. So taking in that there is imperfection in the perfection, right? What is perfection? We are imperfect human beings and that's the perfection is that we are imperfect. Okay, daily mantra, I express myself with compassion and courage. I express myself with compassion and courage. All right, feel those feelings. Feel your feelings today.